In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to start a tote bag business from home using Shopify and Printful. What's going on everybody? It's your boy Melvin and I'm back again you guys with another video. On this channel, we talk about make money online, print on demand, how to tutorials and reviews. If this is content you like, do me a quick solid. Smash that like button. Destroy that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that notification bell. That way you guys don't miss out on any future videos. And without further ado guys, let's get straight into the content. All right, you guys, so we're going to get started here. If you guys do not have a Shopify store, then guys, sign up, get your 14-day free trial, and get started with Shopify, okay? So right here, I'm on my dashboard. So I'm going to go here, click on apps, guys, and I'm going to open up the Printful app, okay? So you want to get your Shopify store set up, guys. Get your whole website, you know, looking nice, so that way you can start selling and marketing your products, okay? So guys, I'm going to be showing you how to start a tote bag business, okay? So pretty much you just, you download the Printful app. So we'll go back here to Shopify. And if you guys do not have Printful on your Shopify store, guys, all you have to do is just click here, customize your store. And right here, guys, where it says search apps, all you have to do is just type in Printful and it'll be the first one there, okay, guys? So you click on it and you just uh, add the app and it's going to automatically add it to your store guys do all the little sign up process for that so once you're all done guys you will have your app here on the back end okay under installed apps so then guys you just click on it okay and then you're going to be brought over here so guys you're just going to want to add a product to your store and for this example we're going to be using tote bags guys real easy and you guys can do this stuff real easy guys okay so we're going to go here guys and we're gonna be looking up some accessories and right here under bags, tote bags. We're gonna click on that. So right here you have options, okay? So this is a all over print large tote bag with pocket. That's a good one, okay? And this one is a all over print tote bag. So for this example, we'll just go with the bigger one, guys, okay? So we're gonna click on it. And guys, you guys can add a design all over this, okay? You guys can customize it to however you like. So guys, you guys are probably wondering, okay, how can I do this, you know? How can I design the whole process? No problem. Right here where it says product info, pricing, and guidelines, you click there. And right here, you're going to want to download this template, okay? So it's one size, okay? The all over print and in the inside pocket. So these are the dimensions. You guys can use Adobe Illustrator for this process, guys. Or if you guys just want to do simple designs, Printful actually gives some awesome you know designs right so right here under premium images guys you guys can click there and printful has options okay so let's say you want to go with something like that okay so it says right here plus one dollar so that'd be an extra dollar okay guys to be using this image here okay but check this out guys okay you have options here so let's go with this first one and as you can see here guys it already added it on okay so for the inside pocket we're just gonna just do the same design okay this is just as an example guys on how you guys can do this okay so right here you see the print quality is good and if you want to see how it will look on the bag right here just click on mock-up view and you can get an example of how it's gonna look guys okay and there you have it guys okay so these are images you can use right and you can go on Canva, guys, upload these images and create some nice, you know, post and some nice um, video ads, right? For TikTok and for Instagram Reels. Real simple, guys. It's not rocket science and you guys can kill it with this, okay? But let's say you guys want to create something real unique. Put a nice design on there, okay? Well, guys, what we're going to do is we're going to go back and click this all over print large tote bag, okay? And I'm gonna click right here to product info pricing and guidelines. I'm gonna go to print file templates. I'm gonna download this, okay? So it's gonna download and it's gonna open up, okay? All right, you guys, so after you downloaded the template, guys, what you're gonna wanna do is go over to Adobe Illustrator, okay? And right here, guys, you can open up your template. Just simply go to file, open, and just find the template that you downloaded so it'll be right there guys and open it i already have it open guys i just wanted to show you guys how to do it so guys after you're here guys the template's gonna be here okay so right here as you can see when i'm highlighting over it you can see like the blue line just leave your cursor 
where it shows the blue line over it guys just uh, copy it okay so I'm gonna hit command C because I'm on a Mac and then what I'm gonna do guys is I'm gonna go to file I'm gonna go to new and I'm gonna open up the actual a new file 21 inches by 30 37 inches okay and this is the orientation then I'm gonna hit create so after I do that guys what I'm gonna do is hit command V to paste and I'm gonna bring this path down okay so now I'm gonna bring it over and as you can see guys it's not aligning right like it's corner to corner but it's okay as long as it's inside that actual template guys you're good so now that it's in there guys what I'm gonna do is make sure the selection tool is selected guys and just click on these paths here okay Let's see click that box I'm gonna hit delete okay just like that guys and you're gonna want to do that for each one okay all right cool so then now what I'm gonna do guys is I'm gonna bring in a PNG whatever design you actually want to put in your tote bag guys this is the perfect time to do so actually what I forgot to do guys before you actually put this in there okay before you actually put this actual uh, template inside this template guys what you want to do is just change the color okay just make sure you hit the selection tool guys and you want to fill this whole thing up okay so right here corner to corner okay, I'm gonna go up and I'm gonna make sure that is filled okay so then after that I'm gonna pick my color so for this example guys I'm gonna choose black and after you pick your color guys just hit the selection tool again just click on this path right here guys and just bring it over as you can see it's going to the back all you have to do guys is right click okay uh, arrange and just bring forward okay so then all you want to do is bring this path inside and to where it's inside the actual guideline okay so right there guys I'm gonna start placing my design here okay so I'm gonna open up my finder I'm gonna go and what I'm gonna do guys is I'm gonna drag in the design okay so then now that I drag in my design guys okay remember this this um this shape right here is is basically the back side okay so what we want to do is pretty much going to be upside down so I'm gonna actually flip it like that guys flip it horizontally and then I'm gonna flip it vertically okay I'm gonna hold down shift and I'm gonna grab one of the corners guys and just drag it down to where it's, it's inside okay so then right there and there you go it's in the center so all I'm gonna do guys is as is highlighted I'm just gonna hit command C to copy it and I'm gonna hit command V and just bring it up so then what you're gonna want to do here guys is actually flip it uh, vertically and horizontally again and there you have it okay and you can actually drag it to where it intersects okay so let's say you're satisfied with this okay so you see this green Okay, that you actually uh, put in there guys all you're gonna have to do all you're gonna do is hit delete and there you have it so now guys what you guys can do here is literally go to file go to export export as okay name name it whatever you want guys so for this example I'm gonna put example 2 and you want to make sure you uh, click use artboard okay guys so then after that all you do is just hit export hit OK and then what you're gonna want to do guys is go back over to print okay just hit drop your design here you're gonna hit upload and you're gonna go look for that design you exported from Adobe Illustrator okay so right here I'm actually gonna place it here and I'm gonna hit select and there you have it guys okay and here's here's one thing I want you guys to, to check out okay so let's, let's actually have a mock-up view see how it's gonna look look at that guys looks good to me okay so that's how you could do it with Adobe Illustrator you guys can actually put some quick designs that Printful already has to offer okay so then I want to actually point this out guys go back on Adobe Illustrator so I want to show you guys this template okay so this was you want to repeat that process okay for this um, inside pocket as well okay so all you have to do is just rinse and repeat that same process I just did for the tote bag you want to do it for the front flaps and the inside pocket so that way guys everything could be fall falling into place okay but for this example that is how you could do it guys and now what you want to do is 
go right here to proceed media and you're gonna wanna actually pick your mock-up, okay? That's gonna go on your website. So after you pick your mock-up, we're just gonna go with this main one. We're gonna hit proceed to details. I'm gonna type in here. I can and I will. And once you have your store optimized, guys, and you can start adding tags, okay? So as you can see here, guys, I used that as an example before, but you'll wanna do something like that, guys. So that way when you upload it, it can properly categorize it, okay? So right here, guys, you guys got product locations here. Then you could just choose where you want this product to go, okay? Which actual page. So I'm just going to leave that blank for right now, guys. I'm going to go right here to proceed to pricing. And so Printful's price, basically your price is $24.95. And for profit, guys, $10.05. So retail, so the customer will be paying $35. If you're okay with making 10 bucks profit, guys, then you guys can leave it just how it is, guys. Or if you guys wanna change it, you guys can change it here, okay? So you can put, you wanna sell it at 40, whatever, you know, you guys can do that, okay? Then your profit is gonna be $15.05, okay? So that's pretty much how you can do it. I'm actually gonna change that. I'm okay with 10 bucks. I'm gonna hit submit to store, okay? So it's gonna take a little bit for it to uh, submit. Then afterwards, guys, I'm gonna show you guys the next steps. All right, you guys, so now that product is in the store, okay? So one way for you guys to go and take a look at your store, guys, is go back on your Shopify dashboard and you wanna hit on online store, okay? Just click on that, guys, and it's gonna go to the actual website, okay? So then right here, I'm gonna go. So for right here, guys, I did not add it to a collection. You know, I skipped over that, guys. So. I'm gonna type in something like tote bags right here in that search bar guys and as you can see that product is on my store okay so I just added it for the sake of this video guys but I'm actually gonna delete it so right here it's all pre-populated one thing I forgot to mention guys that is really important that you guys do is make a really good SEO descriptive description okay for your product okay so that way it can be found on Google so always use uh, some targeted keywords guys a tool that I like to use H super tools guys I say you guys check it out okay so right here guys you guys can go right here to this YouTube keyword tool SEO as well has a research tool and right here guys I'm just gonna type in something like tote bags okay and as you can see here, guys, it shows the monthly volume, okay? Like what words are actually easy to rank for, okay? On Google and on YouTube, all right, guys? So you can go through here, guys, see what keywords. Just make sure you add them in your description, guys, okay? For SEO purposes, and guys, that is pretty much it. That product is now in the store. So that is how you can sit here, guys, and start selling tote bags in your business. But you're probably asking, where can I get some ideas right on designs? Well, guys, you go over to Etsy, okay? And you type in tote bag PNG designs. And as you can see here, guys, there's a variety of designs that you guys can use on your tote bags, right? Just to get an idea on how to do it. And sometimes, guys, you could even find, you could even find files, right? Adobe Illustrator files where you can sit here and edit those designs you know so if it says a certain name you can edit it in Adobe Illustrator to say whatever you want okay then you export those designs and guys you could put them on your tote bags okay so that is um that is how you can do it guys with Adobe Illustrator it's real simple you know in the beginning is you gotta like learn the uh, process right of Adobe Illustrator you know it's a little learning curve to it but after you do it for a while guys it's fairly simple so if you guys are not educated on Adobe Illustrator I say you guys get educated on Adobe Illustrator because it's crucial right I mean you could do so much and the designs are gonna be crispy all right you guys to give you guys an overview right you want to start your 14 day free trial with Shopify okay so after you do your 14 day free trial with Shopify you know set your store up okay set your theme up get it going right optimize it for sales okay then you want to download the app Printful, okay? And after you download the app Printful, then you could start getting creative, right? And whatever business you actually want to run. If you want to run a tote bag business, then guys, you guys can do so, okay? And I showed you guys how to do it. And it's real simple, guys. You guys can easily, you know, do quick designs, okay? 
so we're gonna pick this one again just to show you guys okay premium images guys and you guys can choose images that printful already has to offer or you guys can design it the way i showed you guys in adobe illustrator you guys can go on etsy and actually find some amazing designs as well but guys you guys after you're done with that you guys can start making um tiktok videos okay start posting on instagram start using models okay so if you go right here to place it guys i will i will leave a link in the description below guys where you guys can sign up with place it it's an amazing platform right and you can start marketing your products okay using models so as you can see here you have models holding tote bags okay and you can actually decorate it the way you decorated it for your store and you can put this up on social media okay TikTok, instagram you can even use Twitter, guys. Use any platform, Facebook. Make a Facebook page promoting your products, okay? And let me tell you, by doing this process, guys, you're optimizing your store for sales, okay? If you want to do Facebook ads, great. But guys, I'm a true fan of organic traffic, and TikTok is the way to go, okay? So, just I wanted to share that with you guys, okay? Now that I showed you guys how to design tote bags, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, guys on a tote bag business is this is something you're interested in guys let me know in the comment section what business you're actually interested in starting and you don't know where to start i'll be more than happy to make some videos on that guys i appreciate you guys stopping by my channel if you guys found value in this video do me a quick solid smash that like button destroy that subscribe button make sure you hit that notification bell that way you guys don't miss out on any future videos and i'll see you guys in the next video thank you for watching